Hi everyone, today we'll be learning about the HCF. This is the highest common factor. Let's get, it to, let's get into some examples. And by the end of the video, you'll probably understand the HCF. Okay, so the first question is going to be 12 and 18. So the first thing we need to do is find the factors of both 12 and 18. So in this case for 12, it's going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, and 12. For 18, it's going to be 1, 2, 3, 6, 9, and 18. So now we tick what's in common and see what the highest common factor is. So 1 is present in 18, 2 is present in 18, 3 is present in 18, 4 is not present in 18, so we cross that out, 6 is present in 18, 9 is not present in, eight, is not present in 12, and 12 is not present in 18, and 18 is not present in 12, so we cross that out. So now we see what the highest common factor is. So the highest common factor in this case is 6. So the H C F equals 6 of 12 and 18. Okay, let's move on to 36 and 12. Okay, so now we do the same thing to 36 and 12. Okay, so for 36, it's going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 8, 9, 12, 18, and 36. So now we do that to 12. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, and 12. So now we tick what's in common. So 1 is present in both 36 and 12. 2, 3, 4, 6, 8 is not present. 9 is not present. 12 is present. 18 and 36 are not present. So now we see what the highest common factor is. In this case, it's 12. So the HCF of 36 and 12 equals 12. Now let's move on to 45 and 15. Okay. So same thing, we need to find the factors of both 45 and 15. Okay, so for 45, it's going to be 1, it's going to be 3, 5, 9, 15, and 45. So now we do that to 15. So it's going to be 1, 3, 5, and 15. So now we tick what's in common. So 1, 3, 5, 9 is not present, so it's out. 15 is present, 45 is not. So now we have to see what the highest common factor is. So in this case, it's 15. Now we've Now the highest common factor of 45 and 15 gives us 15. Okay, now let's move on to 6 and 8. Same thing. So for 6, it's going to be 1, 2, 3, and 6. For 8, it's going to be 1, 2, 4, 
than 8. So now we just tick what's in common, and we'll see what the highest common factor is. So 1, 1, 2, 2, 3 is not present, 4 isn't, and 6 and 8. In this case, 2 is our highest common factor, so we circle 2. 8cf of 6 and 8 gives us 2. Okay, now let's move on to 9 and 12. Okay, same thing. Let's find the factors of both 9 and 12. So 1, 3, and 9. For 12, it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, and 12. So now let's tick what's in common. So 1, and now we cross out 2, we tick 3, 3, cross out 4, 6, 9, and 12. So now in this case it's 3. So 3 is our highest common factor. So 8cf of 9 and 12 gives us 3. Thank you for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed this video on 8CF and bye.